Hi everyone and welcome back to How to Train Your Dragon. I'm here with my dragon, Philip. For those who are unacquainted with Philip, Philip is my lap dragon. He's around the Cavoodle equivalent of a dragon. Game of Thrones, racist. Skyrim, racist. I'm out here to break all the negative connotative portrayals of dragons throughout the media. It is disrespectful and they typecast all dragons as villains throughout these films and I will not stand for it. Philip over here is actually a children's novelist. He wrote three children's books, one of which is on the New York Times bestseller list. Stop dragging me around, mum. It's about a dragon on his search in a supermarket to find lollies. But many don't know that he has a PhD in philosophy. Profound. How to train your dragon. Now who said that you can't teach old dragons new tricks? That's wrong. Philip is 500 years old and I just taught him how to backflip. Wow. Traveling with your dragon. As you can see, Philip can fly, but there are international flight bans, and Philip is not above the law. Therefore, Philip actually has to have his flying license. When you travel overseas with Philip, he does have emergency exit doors. Here are photos of us in Paris, China, and New Zealand.